Alrighty, thank you again for joining me this week. Back on with the Outer Worlds. The distress signal. Boarding the ship. And turn it in. Please, would you kindly inform the crew that long chats with Ada are not required every time the captain leaves the ship? <laughs> Snake skin. Book. The Groundbreaker has approved our request for docking, Captain. You're free to disembark. I guess I already have them. Continue. Vodka. Glass. Class. The spectrum. Either of the assault cruisers ever put in the groundbreaker? Rest and go. Have you had a moment to look into that little opportunity I told you about on Roseway? You don't hurry up. Someone will get to snooping around there before you do. Investigated the distress signal from Roseway. What's that? Speak up now. Gretz, you asked me to look. What'd you turn up? I found a toothpaste formula, but then I unfound it. Well, that's just... Just swell, sweetheart. Good for you. I acquired some research on Raptodon Musk, but I found another buyer. A shame you didn't visit old Gladys first. That would have fetched a good price. I may have thrown in a batch of my famous sugar cookies just to sweeten the deal. If Auntie Cleo's exporting wraps from Monarch... Golly me, someone's going to be in the soup when they get caught. I found a prototype medic from Force, but I lost it. Bless your slippery little fingers. Isn't that just a shame? Prototype schematics go for a fair handful of bits around here. That's it. Darnation. It sounded like a gold mine, but maybe that's just my old hopes getting in the way. I suppose it can't be helped. Law bless you for doing the legwork, sweetie. Don't forget your pal Gladys now. You can come visit any time. Fantastic. Do be careful with it, dear. 
as these keys tend to be a tad hard to acquire. You should have a chat with Lilia Hagen in the sublight offices. She's a tear. You'll love her. Now, was there anything else? Anytime, sweetheart. You know where to find me. Hey, boss. If you need a tour guide, I've seen all 12 episodes of Terror on Monarch. Kind of an expert. As long as there's paying work, you can count me in. See, we had a conveyor pull in. One of them into Why was I built to feel unneed? Welcome back, Captain. Now that you have acquired a nav key to Stellar Bay, would you like me to contact Dr. Wells? It's key. Well done. You'll love Monarch. Exotic climate, violent native species, fascinating culture, really. You'll need to speak with Hiram Blythe. He's known as the information broker, and for good reason. If anyone knows where I can find those chemicals, it's Hiram. I need those chemicals to revive the Hope's colonists. They can help us fight back against the board. They can help us set things right. If we don't put a stop to the board, they're going to drive this colony toward a complete societal collapse. You'll see what I mean when you arrive on Monarch. Just tell me what to do. You'll want to hire the services of a skilled guide. I recommend a hunter by the name of Nioka. Frequents the drinking establishments of Stellar Bay. Very hard to miss. Once you have everything you need, make your way to Hiram Blythe's compound. Alright, I'm off. Best of luck. Everyone on the Hope is counting on you.
Destination reached. Scylla. Please avoid damaging your self or others while you're out. No laws, no lines, and a whole lot of guns. I love this place. I only ever seen this asteroid on the pages of thrilling space adventures. Alert. Beginning security control. Looks like we're doing this. Oh, that's the last of them. Nothing on Earth. I can take a hint. doing this.
Don't try that again. You didn't have to shoot me down if you wanted to. Looks got his ass. Nice. Multiple fractures, laceration, and untreated burns I heard detected. Hey, whoever did Signs this, indicative of sudden violent crash, crash landing. Yep, that's me. No big deal. Just shrugging off my injuries as I stroll away from another flaming impact crater. Also detecting constipation, hair loss, reduced fertility due to tight trousers. It's a bus! I'm warmed up now. <laughs> Padded helmet. Tremendous work, friend. Here I was readying a daring maneuver, and you've come and saved me the trouble. Why does that sound familiar? Ah, uh -uh, it's Ellie. Excellent timing. Hello, Ellie. What a pleasure it is to see your sparkling beauty in this barren waste. It's Dr. Fenhill. I certainly know his ex-crew. Mostly from the operating table. I've probably seen more of them than he has. How cruel you are. I distinctly remember a special party at the Lost Hope Bar on Groundbreaker where we... We did not. Oh, fine. But we almost... Keep going and you're gonna see how good this Automac is at picking up teeth. Symptoms detected. Elevated heart rate. Dilated pupils. Increased sweat production. Subject appears to be terrified. I'm not terrified, you bucket of bolts. That's victory sweat. Sure, buddy. Meds, I'm guessing. Pirates love bits, and unlabeled meds are worth a bundle. Supposed to be for the groundbreaker, but getting shot tends to hinder one's delivery plans. <laughs> it does the groundbreaker. Hey, who are you calling bootleg? I'll have you know these are 100% genuine stolen drugs. Fine, why does it mean stolen drugs? Because the board, in all their herpetological wisdom, will only sell the meds at a huge markup. 
Groundbreaker knows better than to pay board prices. Not when they've got me running for them. More importantly, they can't afford to. I take it? The one and only. Uh, wait, who's asking? Wanda didn't send you, did she? I swear. Land on Groundbreaker, even a moment tardy, and that busybody's already been up your ass an hour. You tell her these Automex are coming, and sending a hired stooge to rescue me from certain peril only furthers my delay. No offense. Yes, well, I shan't. Give Wanda my chilliest regards. And farewell to you, dear Dr. Fenhill, I trust I'll see you next I find myself on the Groundbreaker. You'd better hope not. After repeatedly getting beaten up by primals, you know what? Attack you. to be uh very long. Oh, I've seen one of these before. This year's, uh, Planet Maker Upper? Uh, terraformer, that's the word. There's no credible research on the health effects of standing directly under a terraformer, Captain. In case you were wondering. It's probably a good idea.
peace? Hey, Ellie, you want to know what I think? I think they ought to make a serial about our crew. Only, we'd have all these secret messages in every episode, see? What happened to the Code of Silence, Felix? Hey, why do you always do that thing with your eyes whenever I talk to you? You on the alert, maybe? Looking out for... Place never even had a bar. No wonder it's abandoned. Maybe it's haunted. We should look around. I want to continue. to imagine leaving something as expensive as a terraformer lying around. I wonder what it'd take to knock this over. Uh, honestly, I should probably call it for this week.